this is it. This is that moment you've been waiting for. Hear the sounds, feel the breeze, smell the flowers. Feel the love that's surrounding you right now. Now what you're doing right now, remember to do often in your marriage. Even when you don't want to. <laughs> In fact, especially when you don't want to, because it'll take you back to this moment in time and you'll remember what really matters. Twenty-five years ago, when Scott married Megan's mom, he made a vow to Megan to love and to care for her as his own. As a token of that vow, he presented a necklace to Megan. Megan is wearing that necklace today. It's in the shape of a heart, and it has Scott and Denise's wedding date engraved on the back. On the front it says, He who holds the key unlocks my heart. Scott has held that key for the past 25 years. Scott, do you have that key with you today? Are you prepared to turn that key over to Steve? <laughs> Megan, we wish for you joy and peace because those things can only be found in the Lord and be shared with the gift that he has provided you this day in Stephen. There will be hardships and times of unhappiness and lack of earthly success, but even in those times, you can still find joy and peace. We love you and we're excited for you. I love you so much. For the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Stephen and Megan Tully. What more can I say about Steven? Steven's the guy everyone always wants to be around. Even when we were little, my imaginary friend would ignore me and want to play with him. <laughs> when we met Steven and realized that he was just as intelligent and outgoing as Megan was, we knew that he was it. A famous writer once said, don't ask a man what is important to him, watch how he spends his time. Well, I've watched how Steven spends his time, and I can see what's important to him. And that's you, Megan. It warms my heart to see that she has found someone who looks at her every day and finds joy in making sure that her well-being and happiness is his priority. Steven, you are a true partner for Megan. And I don't think anybody had a second thought about that. It is a privilege to welcome you to our family. You guys truly do bring out the best in each other, and we're so happy to be gaining another brother in the family, Stephen. May God be with you and bless you. May you see your children's children. May you be poor in misfortune and rich in blessings. May you know nothing but happiness from this day forward. And may you name your first child after me. Cheers. Cheers.